Well, here we are again, another early morning out by the sea doing some landscape photography. I'm at Isleta del Bagnets or Bagnets or El Bagnets or La Bassa de la Reina. And uh, well, we'll see what we can do this morning. I hope you'll enjoy the video. If you do and you're new here, don't forget to hit subscribe before you go. Hey everyone, thanks for joining me. Still keeping pretty local at the moment. Uh, the town to the north and to the south of here have both got night curfews, which does make it a bit difficult to go <laughs> anywhere. In the next few days, maybe the next week or so, as sunrise is getting a bit later, it's gonna make it possible for me to go a bit further afield in the mornings. And I'm even toying with the idea of doing an afternoon stroke evening trip out despite the heat. We'll see how that goes. Right now, I am on uh, the end of Isleta del Bagnets in El Campeo. It's also called La Bassa de la Reina because of the baths of the Moorish Queen are here. It's actually an old Roman fish farm. And I've got a scene set up that I'm going to shoot right now. Let me talk you through it. Okay, so this is the scene that I've got set up. We've got this kind of little island thing in the middle, and then the rocky area frames it all the way round. And then some fairly nice cloud. I don't think we're gonna see a lot of light this morning, not with all of this cloud, but we'll see. And uh, I'm gonna shoot a one minute exposure. I've actually got a three stop hard edged ND grad on just to Hold that sky back because it's quite a lot brighter than the foreground. Let's get it going, shall we? I think that looks pretty nice actually. Okay, I've got my long exposure of this scene. Now, I'm just gonna wait for it to get brighter until I can get, well, maybe a second, try that, and then we'll maybe try half a second and try and capture some texture and patterns in the waves. This might end up being, you know, kind of a blended image, this second one, because what I might do is capture, you know, waves breaking in different parts of the scene and try and blend them in. No more than two or three though.
So at the moment, I've just taken the ISO up to 200. Uh, that's letting me get, well, I've been doing a few shots at 0.8 of a second. I'm now at 0.6. I'm just going to keep taking a few shots as the waves come in. We had some really nice big waves earlier, but they seem to have backed off a bit now. We're pretty much at sunrise now. We're not going to get much in the way of light or colour. But sometimes, sort of around or just after sunrise, the waves will pick up again here. So I'm kind of hoping that's what's going to happen now. It got really breezy a couple of minutes ago, and again, that's died off. So the weather's a bit strange this morning. Well, the sun is up. It's uh, broken through some slightly denser cloud into uh, an area of kind of hazy cloud. So it's kind of a, like a washed out globe out there. But it's, uh, there's some quite nice patterns and some subtle tones in the sky. Uh, I've dropped the remote because I can't use high speed continuous shooting with the remote. And that's what I want to do to try and capture these waves. But I've got the tripod nice and solid and the camera nice and solid on the tripod. So hopefully me pressing the shutter button isn't going to cause too many problems. Down to about a quarter of a second now and just carrying on with a few shots. Okay, we had a couple of moments there where the waves did rush in quite nicely. I think I managed to get some shots. I'm not sure if I managed to get any video of them, but I did manage to get some shots. Uh, I'm thinking there's maybe a couple of them that will be combined for one image, I don't know. It'd be interesting to compare the long exposure that I took earlier and the mood that that has compared with the uh, a much shorter exposure with the waves breaking and the, the sun, albeit quite sort of watery <laughs> in the frame. You all already have seen what I managed to get. So I hope you've enjoyed them. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please give it a like, share it on social media. Don't forget about leaving me a comment. If you've enjoyed this video and you're new here, don't forget to hit subscribe before you go. And as always, I really appreciate you taking the time to watch. So thank you very much. And until the next video, Bye.